The chat you had with Dr. Ogorov paints a better picture of what Malgus may have been up to. Darth Knoll's work on mind control says a lot, but combining Sith and Jedi toys? That's big news. Malgus following in the footsteps of someone with Jedi connections is a plot twist I wasn't expecting. Never mind Heather Cole getting her hands on Darth Knoll's holocron. Has Malgus been behaving himself? Haven't seen any security alerts since the last time you were here. He can't use mind tricks on the droids, and no one gets in without our say-so. You could say he's been on his best behavior, but he weren't so uncooperative. What we learned about Darth Null's Jedi influence does give us something to go on, though admittedly not much. Hands up. Looks like we have a special guest. Tell these droids to get out of my way. I need to speak to Malgus. They answer only to the Emperor and cannot be overridden, Shay. Some higher-up is all sweaty about my past contracts with Malgus. They've got no understanding of how those things work. One of those contracts was destroying the defense grid on Coruscant during an Imperial invasion. I was there to do a job. I did it and moved on. You should understand that. Perhaps, but permission to interrogate the prisoner is restricted to a select few. I'm going to find out if he's working with head up, with or without permission. That's why I'm here. We all need to know more about his plan. Don't you get it? With the Holocron, Hedda is part of that plan, willing or not. You weren't interested in the Holocron when we ran into Sahar. I wasn't, but I won't let Hedda use whatever's on there to hurt my people. So, what's it gonna be? We'll work together on this. Smart move. Doesn't change the fact that Shay isn't on the VIP list. Then put me on comms. Comms? To listen in? More than that, Shay can give advice during my questioning. Malgus had a few bad habits when I worked with him. I'm betting they're still there. If you listen to me, we can trip him up. Risky. But the situation calls for it. At least we'll be in full control. If anything seems wrong, we can shut it down. All right. Everyone be on your guard. Time to pay our guest a visit. Ready? Always. Bottom line, threats are useless against Malgus. He fears nothing. You keep talking about putting an end to what he wants, and we'll get nowhere. Make him think you understand. That's the key to getting anything out of him. If you explain to me what you hope to accomplish, maybe I can help you. Maybe there's another way to finish what you started. A way that others will accept. Few minds can comprehend my vision. There are none like you in the galaxy. But you are alone. That is a strength. Attachment becomes weakness. Good. He's talking. Risk a question. Only a fool refuses a powerful ally. Losing our only chance to ask about Hedda. I want to know how Hedda Cole fits into your plan. I have no need for the Mandalorians or their quarrels. An endless cycle of waste and fodder. Useless. Big talk from inside that cell. I can understand how someone would think the Mandalorians are unreliable. Watch it. But I haven't once regretted having them as allies. 
Not yet. Liberator quarries. Okay, maybe Hedda wasn't part of his plan, but something sure as hell changed. Do you still believe your plan will succeed without you? Is that why you let others carry the torch? Strength begets strength. All else will wither and fade. Even you. Strength comes in many forms. Some more valuable than others. I will tear apart the corrupt systems that allow weakness to infect the galaxy. I will stop the rot. I will burn down all of their failing legacies and see who embraces the flame. More of his mystical 06. What about the Holocron? Does Hedda have something she can use against my people? Who whispers in your ear? Do not ignore me, Malgus. I am not finished with you. This is too late. Your thoughts are plain to me, Mandalore the Avenger. Your rage consumes you. There was a battle, and your prey slipped through your fingers. Your people are divided, while Heta Cole gathers her army. You are right to come begging for answers. Heta. Will destroy you. Where is she? Zinina Hutun, answer me! looms over us all a shadow of unchanging history there are fools who believe they can outrun the shadow without a flame to chase it away it will consume them they are doomed to repeat the same failures none who have stood by my side have understood this the only one who could have is my enemy A shame that you and I must remain that way. Nothing lasts forever. you answered. I must make an unusual request. What's going on? Is everything all right? Yes. For the moment, I have been summoned by the three. What they have to say has left me disquieted. Meet me at these coordinates on Vos, and I will explain in greater detail. I sent you to look into the origins of one of Darth Null's relics. I haven't heard any update. What I found... It is best if I show you in person. I will await your arrival. Voss. Hm. Well, at least...
least it's nice this time of year. We have enough mysteries to contend with without getting the Voss involved. They're not exactly known for being straightforward. Sana Ray sounded unlike herself. I do hope whatever she has to tell you isn't too troubling.